count the 16 people. Yeah, we can start. Okay. Hello, everyone. This is Anthony Sabali from Lebanon, working with RSS, Robotic Surgical System, the sister company for Gulf Drug uh, in Dubai. Uh, we are distributor for three uh, robotics technology in the healthcare field. Uh, one of them is the CMR surgical robot, another one in the uh, microsurgery, which is VHS technologies, and a third one in the cardiovascular for Siemens Halfenier Corellis. Uh, we're going to talk a bit about CMR, which is the soft tissue surgical robot in which we can see over here a setup of three arms, uh, all connected to, a, to the patient. Each one of those arms has a five millimeter trocar with a five millimeter instrument. We have the vision, which is the eyes of the surgeon. And what we have, an, and we CMR made and created, is an arm that mimic the human arm. So we have the wrist. We have the elbow and we have the shoulder. Other than that, we have a scope that has a zero degree angle and a 30 degree angle, which depends on the surgeon preference because all what we have here and what we call it robotic assisted surgery is not about the robot working alone. The robot will be assisted by the surgeon who's gonna be working here over the surgeon console, which we made it and we designed it as an open console to do the benefits of laparoscopy and try to apply them robotically. First of all, we have an image of 2D, so the surgeon would be able to see in 2D, or he will be able to see in 3D by wearing the 3D glasses over here, and then he will be able to operate. We'll give him the option, the surgeon, to operate standing up or sitting down. The operation and this uh, console is ergonomically designed, so he will be able to lower the height of the surgeon, and instead of working standing up, he will be able to work as well as an option, st standing, instead of standing up, sitting down on a console, having the ergonomics he wants, we would lower and raise the screen as well, We have the option to record the video immediately and save it on an SD card for the reference of the surgeon later on. This system is icon, color, and audio based. So everything we, we want to know, we can just check the icons on the screen. We have cursor that we can manipulate from here and we can as well press to engage the instrument. In this system that has been designed by CMR, you don't have to worry about the pedals, and this made it all in hands. So the surgeon has all the manipulation and the function that he needs, to, he needs to do in robotics in his hands, which are the clutch, the energy button, the manipulation of the scope by zooming out, zooming in, rotating right, rotating left, panning up, panning down, going left and going right as well. Those are used, we hold it like a gun always. We use the thumb and the index and the others to hold the controller. With the thumb, we will be able to, as I said, manipulate those here, the three functions, and the jaws opening and uh, closure of the jaws will be by opening and closing the index as well. Uh, all the translation, all the movement will be translated, as I said, from here to there, to the arms. We at CMR always say that you have the option to think laparoscopically and operate robotically because you have many options. The first one is the trocar five millimeters, the freedom of port placement because it's a modular system. So all these arms are working in synchronization uh, but each one is working forward like laparoscopy. The second thing as well is the option of working standing up or sitting down, standing up like laparoscopy as well. The option of having everything is hand without pedals, which made it as well uh, kind of thinking laparoscopy operating robotically. Uh, with CMR, they launched uh, recently what we call the VR, the VR that we have over here with the controllers. Nowadays, it's made to, uh, for commercial demo. So the surgeon 
he will be in the world of the OR, he will be able to see how the system works in the OR, the workflow of the OR from draping the, in, the arms, doing the port placement, going into the surgical field over there. And soon it's going to be launched for training where the nurses and the surgeons will be able to set up the system before getting to know the system itself uh, on site. Uh, that's mainly it. This, this surgical robotic platform, as I said, works in soft tissue robotics. So we work in gyne five specialties, the gynecology, the urology, the thoracic, the colorectal, and the general surgery. We cover those five specialties uh, with different procedures. The, those cards are connected definitely to the surgeon console by via wire cables and data cable. As we can see, this system doesn't have a vision card because I, neither throw cards because it gives the freedom to the hospital to choose the throw card they want to choose the throw card and they fit with our system definitely. The tower they have, the electrosurgical unit they have, uh, yeah, so it gives some freedoms for the system, for the hospital to have those. All we sell is the four arms with the surgeon console as well as the scope and all the others will be consumables, robotic instruments and uh, drapes. The last one, the last thing I want to talk about is the VT, the Versus Trainer, which is a compact as well feature we have, which will be connected to the surgeon console. This Versus Trainer, in which we can find 15, up more than 15 exercises that will tackle all the functionalities that the surgeon would work on a surgeon console. Connecting this there will make, will be part of the training process of the surgeon and he will be able to go through all the functionalities and get more familiar with the system. That's it mainly for the system and have a good day.